What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. On today's video, I have a comparison of two bowling balls that you guys have been requesting for a long time and one that I'm very interested in because it's going to determine my game three ball in league. Yes, we are talking about the all new Storm Journey, the seventh installment in the Belmo series. One that I really like since I have drilled it. And we are going to compare it to the ball that was or currently is my game three ball in league the Roto Grip TNT infused. Yeah, I mean, we're comparing a Pearl and a hybrid for, but for all intents and purposes, this acts like a Pearl, very clean through the fronts, produces a lot of shape, and so does the journey. Now guys, as always, please hit that subscribe button. 80% of the people who watch my videos are not subscribed. So if you are in that 80% and you enjoy the content that I'm putting out, I would appreciate it if you just hit that subscribe button. And then as always in the description, there should be links where you can order a TNT infused or a journey or anything bowling related. It is a great way to help support the channel and what I'm doing here on YouTube. Uh, we're not gonna be bowling on a house shot this time. We are bowling on a 42 foot sports shot, Earl Anthony. Uh, it's sport, but it's in like that borderline between sport and challenge. It's a three to one, so it is much flatter than a house shot. The lane is broken down because I, I just got done uh, filming a video, throwing the pitch black and throwing the magic gem on this lane. So they are transitioned. And this is kind of like the situation when I would go to one of these bowling balls. Let me know down below in the comments. Are you guys excited for this journey like I am? Why or why not? We'll see you here on the lanes. All right, first shot of the video here, we're gonna start in the TNT infused. Then we'll make our way into that journey. That should be pretty good. Oh, see, that went a little bit longer than I thought it was. I'm gonna move two right off that shot, and I think that should be the really good spot there. All right, so I'm gonna make that two board move to the right, keep the ball a little bit more in front of me, see if I can get it to pick up just a hair sooner. Yeah, there we go. That two board move was really good. We're gonna throw one more shot from there for confirmation. Then we're gonna go to the journey. All right, TNT infused, same spot. And then after the shot, we'll talk about the layout on both of these bowling balls. Hook. Oh, I missed right just a hair. And I thought, I mean, that's proof that we're not bowling on a house shot right there. So the layout on both these is exactly the same, being 30 by four and a half by 30. The big differences between these two is that the Journey is a Pearl where the Infused is a hybrid. Infused has a lower RG, Journey has a higher RG and a higher differential. Let's get into the Journey now. All right, first shot with the Journey, same spot that I left off at with the Infused. Oh, that went super long. Let's move right off that shot. All right, so that went super long. I'm gonna move like two right off that, but I think that the move may end up being moving left and kind of slow wheeling it a little bit, but let's see here. Yeah, let's try to move left and kind of slow hook it. That was close, but I think we can get closer. All right, so coming off that shot, I think the move is definitely move left and kind of slow wheel it a little bit. And I think that's what's gonna make this ball really good here. That should be really good. Yep, now if we can post that shot and repeat it, then we'll confirm. All right, so same spot. And then after the shot, we'll throw the infuse from here just to, to see what the differences are gonna be. Wow. We'll throw one more from there with the journey before we get into the infused. I definitely feel that even on this tough pattern, when I move left with this journey, my pocket gets really, really, really big. Oh my God, I've missed right two straight shots humongously. And I don't want to get into the infused until I throw a good shot where I don't miss right to really confirm. But along the journey to that, let's keep striking, I guess. So you guys always hear me talk about the right ball, right part of the lane, yada, yada, yada. This is exactly what I'm talking about. Go to the west before we start practice. Your third game there we go, even with the microphone going. All right, so that was a really good shot. I'm gonna throw one more with the journey from there. 
and then we'll get into the infused. That's the best one so far. Yeah, I mean, that was 10 out of 10. Now let's throw the infused from that same spot. That was a nice little five bagger with the journey. So this is gonna be the same spot with the TNT infused. Do my best to replicate it as best I can here. Yeah, so the biggest difference, I might have missed in a little bit with the infused. It was definitely way smoother, way earlier. Let's throw another shot and actually hit our mark and see what the differences truly are. All right, again, same spot. Let's really hit our mark this time so we can see the differences between these two balls. Yeah, so I'm able to strike, by the way, that's a seven bagger, I think. I'm able to strike from both parts, from the same spot with both of these balls, but the shape is just night and day. And I hope that the camera does a good job at uh, showing that. And if it doesn't, I'm sorry, I'm filming on an iPhone. I'm trying to save money to buy a camera, but I haven't got there yet. Um, the biggest difference is that shape. The infused wants to pick up way earlier, be smoother down lane, where the journey really just wants to get left down lane. So let's throw a couple more shots with the infused. All right, still in the infused here. Let's make another high quality shot here. Oh, miss right. Yeah. See, oh, I thought I was gonna roll it. So I missed right and it didn't, it wanted to hook too soon. So when I got down lane, it didn't have the energy. The journey when I did miss right, both times it actually got back close enough, hit the head pin enough to strike. So let's get back into the journey now. All right, back into the journey. Again, this is way cleaner, way more pop down lane. Miss right on that one also. See, that's exact. oh my God. I, I didn't miss right intentionally that shot, but I wish I would have. That's exactly what I mean. When I miss right, it has enough down lane. It has enough energy stored that when it missed right like that, it gave me enough, the difference between a possible 2A10 and a, a strike. So let's throw another one, but we're gonna hit our mark this time, I promise, or I'm gonna try. I don't normally bowl on sports shots, I normally bowl on house shots, as you guys know. But wow, I can't believe that struck. Yeah, I mean, that was crazy. Just the very next shot, I miss right, and then it strikes with the journey. So this one, we're gonna try our darndest to hit our mark. That's our mark right there. 10 back, same result. So as bowlers, we want the ball in our hand that gives us the biggest pocket. And the journey by far is giving me the bigger pocket right now. Yeah, pretty wild actually at how good of a look I have with this journey. Let's make a good shot here again. Oh, that, no way that strikes. Oh, every time I've missed right, it's, missed, it's been that same miss and it's been that same hit. I mean, I don't know what to tell you guys. Go get yourself a journey. I mean, this is honestly, honestly pretty wild at how good this journey is making me look right now. Oh, missing. Journey says they don't care. All right, we're gonna throw a few more shots here. I mean, I haven't missed the journey in a long time and I've thrown some pretty atrocious shots. So here's to throwing a good shot for the sake of this video. That's a good shot. I mean, throw it good, throw it bad. The results have been the same with the journey. I don't know what to say, guys. Guys, I, I, might, I might just be drinking the Kool-Aid. This journey is freaking amazing. If I'm drinking the Kool-Aid, let me drink it. How good does that look? I mean, I, I really wanted to throw more shots with the infused, but if I'm gonna keep striking, I'm gonna stay in this journey. Jeez. All right, so the last shot of the video, I threw that pretty bad. The last shot of the video, we'll do it in the TNT infused and we'll wrap up the video there. 
All right, TNT infused, same spot, last shot of the video. Unless I strike, if I strike, then, I, then it'll give me one more shot. That should strike. No, it hooked. That's gonna end up being a wrap there for the video. And I think that last shot actually was pretty telling. As you guys saw, the infuse hooked way earlier. I wholeheartedly believe that the journey from there would have struck. And so if I'm figuring out which ball I'm gonna go to and why, if, there, I'm, if I'm experiencing early friction and I need the ball to clear the fronts a little bit easier, it's going to be the journey. And then if I have a lot of head oil, a lot of oil in the front, but I still need something that's gonna be a little boomier down lane, that's when I am going to go to the TNT infused over the journey. But right now, just putting them side by side in my, uh, I'm, I'm putting together a video for my favorite balls of the year, one through whatever, however many balls came out this year. The journey's gonna be ahead of the TNT infused already. Thanks for joining me in this video, I appreciate it. Also, if you're still watching, let me know in the comments, do you want me to do more videos like this on sport shots and not always on a house shot? And let me know why. Till next time.